lot of guts. I mean, when you start investing in in uh, an unknown future, uh, you're, you're you're taking some you're taking some risks there. What's what do you think the parallel today is? The the analogy today is it buy buy internet leads. Well, the parallel that I see is when you are in business, there are times that you're not going to have assurances. There's no, I mean, there's no guarantees every day, but there's certain moments that you say, I think it's going to work. I'm going to go for it. Mm -hmm. And you don't have, you know, if you showed it, if you explained your plan to an accountant or a business attorney, they'd be like, what if, what if, what if they would, what if you to death and you wouldn't do it. But there's times that you have to take a leap. And, you know, I took a leap when I converted us to brokerage model. I took a leap. And there was a few years there, 2013 to 16, even into 17, that it was like, did I make the right decision? I went from having a margin of 20 to 30 percent to a brokerage margin, which is much. So you, when you say switch over, you, you were working as a team. Is that what you built a team within a company? So so okay. think of it this way. From about 04 to 10, it was me and like two people. From right. 10 to 15, it was me and about 15 people, you know, it, it went up as the years went on. Right. But then when I got to 15, I said, okay, no more team model. No more everybody's dependent on Anthony for leads. We're going to recruit agents. I'm going to teach them to do what I did. Okay. And just like just like you said. So yep. from 15 on, it's brokerage model. And that, that's, our, that's where we're staying. I mean, we enjoy the brokerage model. We love it. Um, but when I did that, you know, it was like, I can think of three different times. When I first went on television, we we're spending 6000 a month, Roger. And and to me at that time that was like spending, I mean it, it was like spending a million. A million. It was it was mind yeah. blowing to do that. Yeah. And yeah. I'm spending the money and I'm not getting commissions in. But I said I think this is going to work. I could tell by the calls. So that was probably the first time that I just said I'm going for it. Another time was um, when we started putting a lot of focus into buyer sales around 2012 when we had a team. So we started training buyers agents, sellers agents. By 15, I said, no more buyer's agent, seller's agent. We're brokerage model. That was the third time when I converted the company to brokerage model. And I'd say the fourth time that I am kind of just saying, this is going to work. I'm doing it is now. I'm in one. Roger, we're acquiring a company a month right now. Mm. And, you know, a lot of people, even my dad, you know, my dad had his knee replaced a month ago. He's down the other end of the couch at my house. I'm on this end. And he's like, I like what you're doing, but I'm nervous about one thing. I said, what? He said, why are you the only one doing that? I don't hear or see other real estate companies out buying other companies right now. Are you sure you're not overdoing this? And I said, dad, you said that when I got involved in short sales. You said that when I went on television. He goes, no, no, no. I know I'm with you, but I'm just, are you thinking about that? And it was, it was great dad advice, you know? He